Next is the lab management and control solution. Go to the Benchview app and launch the Benchview Lab Manager application. To configure the lab layout, click on the Lab Configuration tab. There are two options to configure the lab layout. The lab manager can support up to maximum of 100 benches. You can delete the benches to match your lab layout, then add the instrument to the benches. There are basic instruments type such as oscilloscope, function generator, power supply, and digital multimeter. Next is the lab administrator features which allows the educator to monitor the instrument connection and easily identify which instrument or bench is not connected. Click on the check instrument status icon to check all the instrument status. The color code of green indicates the instrument is connected and active. Red indicates that disconnected or connection error. And the gray out shows the instrument is not configured yet. It also allows the lecture to configure all the measurement settings of all lab instruments at once easily. Click the icon of send and select configuration to the instrument. Then you can select the configuration file and send it to the instrument. You can also send the configuration file to all same type of instruments. Besides, the lab admin can perform reset by sending default configuration to the instruments too. A lecturer can always create a configuration or state file and share it with the students as well. The asset tracking features provide a tool for an educator to easily keep track of a long list of assets in the lab including instruments, equipment and accessories. With the functionalities of Manage Instrument, Loaning, Manage Instrument Calibration, and Schedule Auto Reminder System. There are three options to add assets to the system. You can easily track the physical location of instruments. There are the checkout features for you to track the instruments that are sent out for loan, calibration, or repair. By selecting the checkout icon, you can easily track all the required information. You also can configure the calibration reminder and alert. Thanks for watching. 